guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited about today's video and yes, I say that about all my videos but today's just extra special because if you watched uh, one of my previous videos, you know that I signed up with Smile Directs Club and I was accepted into their, um, their club and so um, today I have received my aligners and I'm so excited um, I'm ready to start this journey and sharing it with you guys I will link my last video on small direct club below so that you can go watch it and get more details about it I'm sorry I'm sweating I just came back from the post office and I'm just so excited about this okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started okay Invisible Aligner Guide this is going to tell you step by step on how to use them, how to take care of your aligners and um, what to do and what not to do, all that kind of stuff. Um, I got this in my email as well, so I already read over it, so I'm just not going to. Um, and then I'm assuming these are the aligners. Ooh, look at this. It says snap the aligners onto your teeth and wear them for at least 22 hours a day and I am supposed to be taking them out every single time that I eat and right before I put them back in I am gonna have to brush my teeth um, and it says it's normal for fresh aligners to fit tightly and apply pressure to your teeth this pressure should lessen as you wear each step there's some little tools in here I have some chewies in here and then I do have a filer, I'm assuming to file down any uncomfortable spots. And then uh, this purple tool that's going to help me uh, take off the aligners without me having to use my uh, fingers so that I don't break them. Um, and then it also comes with, ooh, this is nice. It comes with a three month supply of whitening gel and I'm really excited about this because I have been using uh, the whitening gel that I received complimentary from them whenever I went to get go get my impressions done and I have been loving it. I have seen the difference in my teeth and they do, they do appear whiter so I'm really excited to try this again throughout this process and then it also comes with my... Um, with a little box where I can store the aligners anytime that I'm not using them. Again, the only times I'm not going to be using them is whenever I'm eating. And any other time I am going to have them in because I want this process to, to go as planned. And I'm ready for some straight teeth. So, again, I don't have... My teeth are not that bad, but I do have some insecurities. Uh, as you can see, they're not straight, especially on this side. It's just... This is the problem that I actually went in and I told them that it was bothering me. So this is the side that I'm really hoping that I get fixed with this process. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started with my first set of aligners. I'm, I'm just so excited about this. Okay, so it says aligner 1 of 14 and it says 2 week wear. So I'm going to have to wear these aligners for 2 weeks and then trade them out. This is what the little package looks like. Okay. So, ooh, okay. The first pack does come with my first set of aligners that I'm supposed to wear for two weeks. Okay, so which one goes where? These are my top aligners. And I'm just going to go ahead and put them in. I'm scared. <laughs> ah. Okay. They are in. And they are definitely tight. Very tight. I don't feel any uncomfortable spots but they are very tight let me zoom in for you guys so you can see I'm just gonna go ahead and place the bottom aligners on Okay. I feel like the bottom aligners are a lot more tighter than the top. Hmm. Huh. I 
back, honey. I feel like the back. Uh, I feel like the back doesn't click in as well as the front. Which, honestly, the back I'm not really worried about, but. Now that I have the top of liners on, I said that they were tight at first, but now I'm just kind of getting used to it, so I don't feel it. Does that make sense? Yeah, definitely the, the bottom ones are quite tight. Okay, so I'm going to zoom you in again, and I'm going to show you my bite and show you guys me biting down so you can see how much I can bite down. Biting down. As you can see, there's gaps. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my chewies and I'm going to leave you guys zoomed in so that you can see what the chewies do. And the chewies look like this. I'm just going to go ahead and place it. I do feel like a lot of my saliva is going onto my top aligners, so I'm constantly feeling like I have to like suck it all out. I know that sounds gross, but maybe after just sitting there for a while, they just loosen up. I'm not sure because now I'm used to it and I can definitely feel them. They're not uncomfortable, and I don't have any uncomfortable spots like that I have to file down, so that's good. Um, I've seen a lot of videos where a lot of people struggle with that but i don't feel that in my case other thing i feel like um maybe i didn't use the chewy long enough but the back ones i do feel like do need the chewy a little more other than that they feel great it doesn't look like i'm wearing anything and that is the main thing about this because i didn't want to go to a dentist and actually get braces because they're noticeable i don't want to draw any more attention to my teeth than they already get does that make any sense um so I'm just, I'm really excited about this. I will be back later on to update you guys on um, if my teeth get sore, that type of stuff. Um, right now, I don't feel anything. I feel fine. Um, I'm constantly, again, sucking on the saliva to come out of the top aligners. Um, I do feel like I'm talking weird, but I think that's just one of those things that I have to get used to. And I think that you can tell as well because you can tell by how my mouth is moving that I definitely have something in my mouth. So hopefully as we go through the day, I just get used to them and we will see how um, the rest of the day goes. Uh, we have a couple errands to run. Um, I am gonna wear them throughout the day. Uh, I'm gonna pack my toothbrush and my toothpaste because we are gonna run some errands and we might stop somewhere to eat. So um, I definitely wanna have that handy because I, um, if I don't, then I'm gonna have to wait to get home to brush my teeth and then put them back in and I don't want to do that I want to wear them as long as possible as I can so again I will be back later and <laughs> I'm talking funny again I will be back later and I will update you guys on how everything's going with the aligner so I'll be back in just a little while hey guys I'm back for the update and I have been wearing them for approximately I want to say seven hours it is 6:20 in the afternoon i was gonna come back later on at night but i just thought my sunlight's gonna run out and i don't have my lighting right now everything's in the storage still so um so yeah this is the update um let's see where do i even begin when i first put them on um i could feel the tightening and then after a while, I just I just couldn't really feel anything. But now that I have them on for a while, I can definitely feel them. Uh, the edges, I guess, my tongue keeps scraping on them. Um, let's see. I feel like um, I still stand on what I said earlier about saliva going into the top aligners. And I just feel like I'm constantly having to suck it out, which is awkward because I'm sitting there doing it all day. And then um, I feel like on this side, 
in and um it might be because they might be just a little loose i don't know if that makes any sense because they are really tight but i feel like from up here they are a little loose so i'm like i said i'm constantly having to to soak on them to get the saliva out but i i also feel like whenever i i how do i explain this whenever i suck to get the saliva out i feel it tightening more so i know there's still a little extra space um i feel them go up and then down but um they're still on really good um we did go out to eat we went to go have taco bell and i had to run to the restroom to take them off because obviously you can't eat with them on um and i had a very very difficult time trying to take them off because i felt like they were gonna break and i was using that um that purple thing that came in the in the kit and i was pulling it down and it took me a while to be able to take them off and um i was trying to be very cautious but i did end up poking myself a couple times so i did end up bleeding from my gums um but other than that um whenever i did take them off i felt kind of awkward to the point where i wanted to put them back on i don't know why that even makes any sense but i felt better when i had them on because whenever i took them off i felt sensitive and then i started feeling nauseous i felt like i was gonna throw up i didn't even want to eat i was starving before and i didn't even want to eat as soon as i took them off i just didn't feel like eating and um so i guess that's another thing um but overall i feel like they are comfortable i i don't know um like i said i can feel them now more than i did before and um but i feel like I don't really have anything really bad to say because this is a decision that I wanted to go with because I, you know, like I, I stated in my last video on this subject, the fact that I could go to a dentist and just get braces or I can go with Invisalign, which this is another form of Invisalign. It's just a different company and it's way cheaper. So, I mean, I put myself in this situation and um i really want straighter teeth i've been struggling with my teeth all my life and i've always wanted straighter teeth so i just feel like i'm gonna suck it up for the rest of this journey so um i'm ultimately excited to see where um where i will be from now to my second week update which is when i will be coming back with another update for you guys um is whenever i'm trading these out for my second week aligners and um so yeah, I think that, that is it for this video. Um, like I said, I've been wearing them for about seven hours and it's going pretty good. I don't feel any sensitivity. I feel like I can eat normal. I just felt nauseous whenever I did take them off. Um, other than that, I don't think there's anything else to it. Um, if I have any more complaints, I will, um, or if anything just changes throughout throughout these next two weeks, I will be putting it on my Snapchat, my Instagram, and my Facebook. So if you want to go follow me on my other social media, then I will link that down below so that you can go follow me. Um, you can usually find me under Mommy Karen on any social media. I have Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and I'm all under Mommy Karen. So if you want updates throughout the week, um, then definitely go follow me on that. And other than that, I will be back with another update for the second week of this journey so thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next update <laughs> and another thing um my mouth just feel a little extra drier than normal so i <laughs> what are you laughing at okay so my mouth does feel a little more drier than normal and um my lips feel really chapped so i'm constantly having to want to drink water but water's not really doing anything except making me feel more dry i don't know how that happens but my mouth does feel a little dry and my lips are super super chapped they burn really bad i think it's because i've been licking them a lot because i just it's different i've never had any thing going on in my mouth and look i've never had anything going on in my mouth so i guess i'm just constantly licking them i just did it right now and they burn really bad um so i would definitely recommend if you're starting with smile direct definitely bulk up on water and chapstick